Hello, family. So today we're going to talk about Jeezy and Jeannie Mai. So everyone is speculating about uh, what's going on with Jeezy and Jeannie because uh, he filed for a divorce on June the 15th this year, 2023. And uh, the marriage only lasted two years, uh, like a hot second. And they were acting like they were so in love, I guess, until they damn moved in with each other and really found out uh, how each other is. So it was said that uh, maybe Jeannie was cheating or something. Or maybe he uh, got tired of eating uh, noodles and sushi and shit. And uh, wanted some soul food, like some ham hock, collard green, green bean, chitlins, cornbread, uh, mashed potatoes. And uh, she couldn't cook none of that shit. And uh, he probably got tired of eating with damn chopsticks every day. But anyway, uh, I believe that it was uh, probably her mom. She wanted two weddings from the beginning. I believe she run uh, Gina's life. And uh, she can't do nothing without her damn mammy. And I heard that uh, she had moved her mama in and probably... Um, because uh, Gina said she has a nasty attitude. And Jeezy was not going to let her get away with that. She uh, said she tried to talk to him some type of way and he got on her ass. So that's probably uh, what it was. And uh, the Bible tell you anyway, don't uh, be marrying these uh, foreign women. And uh, that's exactly what he did. So he got what he deserved. And then when they got into it, she probably didn't call her mama over there to help her out. Uh, she was scared to be uh, in uh, the house with a black man, even though it was her damn husband. After they got into it, she probably was scared as hell because uh, she let... Freddie, he used to let her run over his ass because he was a damn weak-ass white boy. And then, um, uh, her and, uh, Jeezy probably was celebrating damn Easter, Christmas, Thanksgiving, and Halloween, which is pagan holidays that, the uh, Israelites are not supposed to celebrate. And she wanted to do all that shit. And then they used to pass the baby around from house to house. Sometimes the mama got the child. And sometimes, uh, I believe she was over uh, Gina's brother house. And then she said she was taking advantage of her at uh, nine years old. So why would you uh, let your child go stay with your damn brother sometime? So, yeah, she probably just scared of that black man when uh, he got aggressive on her ass because she wasn't used to that. And then moved his mama in and think uh, Jesus was going to take care of this whole damn family that she uh, had. And then, yeah, I believe her mama was just all in a business because that seemed like the type of woman that she is. And then they probably talk about him. Uh, in their uh language, which I believe is Vietnamese or something like that, she uh, but she looked like a Chinese uh Japanese. Well, I believe all of them the damn same, but anyway, Jesus do not want her anymore, and they're saying that she is begging his ass to stay. And they also said that she probably messing around with Mario Lopez. And uh, 
She just wanted that black man. That black meat on the side, as she said. And uh, she used to uh, being with uh, someone like Freddie, who took that shit for 10 years until he got rid of her ass. Then she said, uh, well, she told him that she didn't want any kids. So he went out and found him another woman and got like uh, a kid or two. And then she got this baby with uh, Jeezy. And then now he end up, he don't want her ass no more. For some reason that we do not know. And probably will never find out. But they saying it got something to do with the family traditions or something like that. But he knew that she was a damn a Vietnamese when he damn married her ass. So... I don't know what went on, but I guess we'll find out sometime later. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.